Okay, this is the Jack and Daxter collection. I just beat Jack and Daxter, the first one. This is an awesome game. I just got the last uh, power cell, which unlocked me the platinum trophy. Uh, got this game a few days ago and it's got some really cool um, trophies it's what really a trophy should be all about I mean and it's got quite a few as you can see this is my second platinum trophy uh, the first one I got was on crack in time ratchet and clank a crack in time but uh, this was a pretty extensive uh, task getting all the trophies in this game, but it didn't take me. I, uh, I got the game Sunday evening and now it's Thursday. And I've played it probably around 15 hours, between 15 and 20 hours to get all the trophies. Um, I'm going to start on jack 2 next which is one of my favorite games of all time I'd actually forgotten how good Jack and Dexter was awesome game but uh here's a view from the um, from each level All the power cells. I beat this game on the PS2 way back. And... But yeah. It's just a really great game. The graphics are awesome in 720p HD. You probably can't tell much about it on this, but they really are outstanding. The graphics are well, well worth. This is the best. Actually, to me, this game alone is worth for the $40 price tag. Just Jack and Daxter. I mean, it was really a lot of fun, and I've still got Jack 2 and Jack 3 to play. So, um, highly recommend picking this game up. And I will hint, give you a hint. This is where I got the last trophy was right through here. I'm not going to spoil it for you. Or the, or the last uh, power cell, which in turn got me the uh, platinum trophy. Because I had to have 101 power cells. That was the final thing I had to do uh, to get the platinum which to get to platinum you have to find everything in the game and, and do every task in the game but anyway hope you enjoy and I hope you uh, pick this collection up uh, now I just hope there's a ratchet and clank HD collection comes out for, that comes out for the PS3 I'm just hoping actually right here is how long it took it tells right here my estimate of 15 to 20 hours was just about right on. It took me 14 hours and 59 minutes to get the last power cell. Uh, so, pretty big game. This is one of my favorite platforming games of all time. It's right up there. The quality of it is just, just amazing. Uh, the high definition upgrade is well, well worth it. Looks really great on the PS3. But, uh, I hope you guys pick it up.